Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Cecilia and I'm so happy to have you here again with another video. Today I'm going to be doing my 2017 beauty favorites. I know I'm a little late on this, but I'm sorry I was in here and I'm barely getting back at it again with the videos. So hope you enjoy and keep on watching. So first I'm going to be starting off with something that really changed my face game and totally my skincare routine like there's like no other for you you're supposed to be using some kind of serum and i showed this in a previous haul like maybe two months ago this is the advanced clinicals collagen it looks like this you can find it in ross um burlington marshall's it's really good i put it in the morning before any creams and at night also before any creams like when I wash my face I put it on I let it sink in and then I use my moisturizer afterwards and oh my god it's been working wonders for me so I love it okay so I really recommend you to go get it. it's just like five or six dollars here it is again advanced clinicals collagen instant plumping serum that's what it says and it's really good it helps your skin like rejuvenate it also helps it like really um plump up and like really soft it leaves your skin soft alive and i mean it's been helping me because my skin was like so dehydrated i really needed something to hydrate it and that's been doing it for me okay so i really recommend it okay and another thing that's really been helping me with dry skin is this Pons crema s that i also had reviewed previously that i did like purchased and i reviewed it that i loved it in a video i just said well it was a video from um, my skin that i was doing my face makeup so i really love the crema s it helps you with dry skin and it just it works wonders for you okay and then I also bought this um, a few months ago. It's the Lanoline Age Divine Cream. And this one really helps you for your skin, your eyes. It's for eyes. And it really helps you with that dryness that you have under your eyes. I mean, you really need to work in with using something for your eyes. Like, you don't want your eyes to be dehydrated or dry under there. And especially if you use makeup, you really have to use this because it's not gonna help you with the concealer. I really had a hard time with my concealer being so dry under there. And I mean, this, been's work, this has been working wonders for me because it's been really good on my eyes and my fine lines. Like, I mean, it's supposed to be a helps you for fine lines, right? But I really feel like it helps your skin plump up a little bit more and you really need to try it. So this one, I found it in I found it in Marshalls. You can also find it in Burlington. It's also very affordable. They sell very affordable stuff there. So I really recommend you to go to those places, Ross, Marshalls, and TJ Maxx also carry stuff like this. And also Burlington. And I recommend you to go. Okay, girl, so don't doubt it. Okay, next, my favorite foundation totally was the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Foundation. I mean, it really does the job. It leaves your skin so flawless, just so beautiful and nature looking. Like, I mean, it gives you some high coverage if you want to. You can always layer it up and it gives you some pretty good coverage. And it's been like a good holy grail foundation. Only $5 to the most $6. I mean, I found it like for $5 at... CVS and I mean I've been using it ever since and I just loved it okay and next I also loved my Maybelline fit me concealer I just love it it gives you like some brown it covers your brown dark circles okay I'm sorry and it's really really good it does wonders also and it's just so affordable and everything and I love it. It gives you the coverage you just need under those eyes, okay? Next, I also loved to set those eyes. I really loved this Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Kit. I got it in medium to tan because whenever they had to sell in the weekly wow in Sephora, there was like no, the other shade that I want, it wasn't there. So I just got this one and it's been working wonders for me and I use this shade to set my eyes all the time 
and I mean it's been really helping me with that creasing under there it leaves my skin soft under there and I really love it okay so it's been working perfectly with my eyes so I love it okay and for contour I loved I just couldn't stop using it my Kat Von D shade and light contour palette it's just been a favorite of mine and I use it all the time as you can see it's really used up I use the middle shade right here and I use the top kind of banana shade for under my eyes also I just can't stop using it guys like it's been so great for me I just loved it and it's just a staple in my everyday makeup that I do I just have to use it so I love it and another one but affordable product is the wet and wild mega glow contour palette very affordable also like five dollars you can also find it cvs walmart heb here in texas and i just love it so it's as you can see i've been using it a lot like i'm almost done with the contour shade i hit pan and i never hit pan on my products hardly so i just love this product again it's very affordable it does the job it gives me good contour right there and i also love the setting powder i use it in dulce de leche so go check it out it's a staple in my collection also thank you for being affordable wet and wild i just love your products they're just so affordable and so good okay next for blush i just can't stop using my elf blush palette in dark like what is up like i just love it as you can see look how used it like how used it is i just use it every day all the time i just can't use another blush and i mean blushes last you like a lifetime so i just recommend you that one the elf palette blush one it's just a staple in my collection also okay and for highlight i love this one from gerard cosmetics and it's the Marilyn highlight. It's just a beautiful golden highlight. And I just love it, okay? It's just so beautiful. And it's, I mean, a pretty color for my skin tone. So I just love it, okay? Next, for lashes, I just use all these lashes all the time, as you can notice in my tutorials. They're the Kiss Lashes and Shine. They're just so pretty, you guys. Like, I mean, they're not the most natural looking lashes but to me they are they're so acceptable to me because they're not that dramatic that like you can use them like most of the time during the day i mean whenever you do your dramatic makeup also they look so pretty with your eyes and i mean they just give you a lift in your lashes and they're just so beautiful i just love them so i just use them all the time i'm sorry if they're just so repetitive in my tutorials but i just can't handle using some other stuff i mean i just love what i use day to day and i keep on using it all the time you know so okay moving on i'm gonna be talking about my favorite two mascaras i use them together i use first i use this one from l'oreal the voluminous carbon black mascara and then after that one i layer it first and then i layer on top of that one the telescopic carbon black from l'oreal also and I just love them together. They do my lashes a little bit like longer and they just give me the good dark black lashes that I want. I mean, because my lashes are really short, so I really need a little bit more volume, darkness and everything. And I mean, they work wonders for me. So I just love these mascaras. Okay, so next for eyeliner, again, When and Wild is always with it. The Wet and Wild Mega Liner in liquid eyeliner i'm sorry and i just love this one it's just the black color one it just gives you your sharp wing i mean it just works good with me the i mean i got used to it i'm sorry i got used to it because i used to use first the nyc one but then they discontinued it so i had to look for another one and then my sister recommended me this one and I found it and I started using it and now I can't leave it and it's so black gives you the perfect wing it's so dark and it stays all day with you okay and I just love it okay next for brows I have to shout out my Anastasia Beverly Hills dip brow pomade in dark brown 
I just love it. It just gives me the perfect shade in my brows. And I just love the definition that it has and everything. It's just the best. I just can't stop using it anymore because my brows, I really don't have dark brows. I wasn't blessed with dark, pretty brows like some other girls. So I have to work really hard for something, like to look for something that really goes with my brows. And I felt like the Anastasia Beverly Hills pomade really did the job on me. So yes, I like that one and it's a favorite. Okay, and for setting those brows, I use the Essence Make Me Brow gel mascara it's called and i just love it it's affordable i use it in the brownie brows it's affordable and it's easy to use and it's just a great product okay i just love it and it's nice with the brows it just lifts them it doesn't let me go and they stay in place all day okay so next i want to move on to my favorite two eyeshadow palettes and oh my god you've seen tutorials on this palette and i just can't stop using it it's the anastasia beverly hills model renaissance palette i think this was a favorite for many people i just love it it has the nice colors in there just the warm browns some pinks and it also has a pretty dark brown like what else like i mean my warm shades right there my pinks my browns and some oranges pretty transition shades i mean i know it's like everyone's favorite but i mean it's also my favorite so here it is in my 2017 beauty favorites okay so next my other palette because i only chose two i mean i could have chosen some other ones because i love so many of my palettes but i chose this one from beauty creations and you've seen tutorials and it's the Leah palette, and I just love this palette. Like, it's everything. I love my mauve shades. Like, I mean, I mainly like it because of the mauve shades that it has here, the purple shades. It has these really pretty creamy shades that are really good. They're just, like, so pigmented, this white. Look at that pigmentation and these purple shades. It has some kind of more um, shimmery shades, and I love this rose gold right there. I did some looks if you want to go check it out go back to some of my tutorials I have some tutorials with this palette it just is so pretty you guys like I just can't stress it enough how pretty this palette is I just love it okay and next for eyeliner I've been loving this black um, this is a pencil liner from Bisu Cosmetics. It's from Mexico, this brand. I just love how black this eyeliner is. And it stays on you all day on your waterline. I just love it. It's Bisu Cosmetics. It's in Mexico, that brand. But, I mean, you can look it online. And it's just so pigmented, this black eyeliner, that it's been my favorite all this year. And I just love it. Okay, next, I'm going to be talking about some of my favorite brushes because I have to talk about some of my favorite brushes here so first I really really want to talk about these wet and wild brushes you guys like these wet and wild brushes oh my god the blending ones like just stop I just love how fluffy they are how pretty they work into my skin blending everything they're just the best and this one also, the shader brush is fluffy and I can also work in product in my crease. Like they helped me so much this year that I was just like blown away by the quality of the brush. Really blending in your shadows. Like I mean, it was like the best. And they don't, they don't shit on you, those brushes. Like they've been so good. Just for one dollar, you guys. Sometimes I get them for 50 cents because there is just like a sell 50 cents off of when and why. I'm like, yes, another brush, and I just buy, like, I have, like, three brushes of each because I just love them so much, those eye brushes. Like, they help me out so much in my makeup game that it's incredible. And then this one for precision, I really love it. It's from Morphe. It's B18 for Morphe. It's a pointy little precision um, blending brush you can say I just love it for packing color and the outer V and then I slowly blend it in and it's just like the perfect brush to do that job and it also works because for this little pointy tip that it has 
I go under my lower lash line and blend it out and I just love it. It's good for everything. Oh my God, it's just like a multi-purpose brush and I just love it. Okay, and also for Morphe, I love this brush. It's a M135. It's like a shader brush, but it's really fluffy. And I love it for my cream eyeshadows to set in my cream shadow here on my crease and down my lid. It's just perfect. It packs the enough color. Like, it leaves all the color in there. I just love it for those shades. Okay. Next, for setting down my eyes, I like this e.l.f. It's a blush brush. That's what it's called. But, you know, I use it more to set in my powder to set in my powder for my eyes it's just the best brush for that and i just love it so i'm gonna still keep on using it this year okay and then for my contour i just love this brush i have to shout out the person that recommended it on youtube bianca canales she's like the best go follow her she does diy's planners and stuff like that and makeup and she shouted out this brush for Melf. i just love it i don't know what's the name but i use it for contour also like her it gives me a chisel contour right there and i just love this brush also for lips i want to talk about my favorite lip liners from nyx and it's mahogany and mauve i mean these have worked wonders because i really love my mauvey lips and oh my god these colors are just the best nyx cosmetics those lip liners are just beautiful okay next my favorite favorite lipsticks from the drugstore maybe even from everything are obviously the maybelline lipsticks the matte ones i just love this formula like they give me so much pigmentation that it's incredible how those lipsticks work like pigmentation color durability because they last all on you all day I mean, they don't hurt on you because they're matte. They don't hurt on you. You can have them all day and they're going to be looking fine for several hours. So I just love them. And then my other favorite lipsticks, I've been loving this one from Anastasia Beverly Hills TV, the lipsticks. I just love this lipstick. It's just so beautiful, burnt reddish, kind of orangey, more reddish burnt burn reddish color i'm sorry and it's so beautiful and i love the formula also and then a favorite um nudish lipstick from milani cosmetics this color is matte naked and i just love it it's just like the perfect nude for me with those nyx cosmetics lip liners i mean they're just everything to me okay and for like sort to say my favorite so my lip cream is from NYX also. I just love it. I love this color. I'm sorry, this color in Prague. I just love it. And Budapest, I think is the name. And I just love that formula. Like it stays on you. I mean, it doesn't dry your lips because I'm really with like, I really have dry lips. So it's really hard for me. Like it's really hard for me to find a formula that stays on me, but doesn't crack my lips. Okay, so. I mean that this is everything for today for my 2017 beauty products and I hope you enjoyed and if you have some favorite products put them down below recommend them to me comment down below like share and subscribe to my channel please hope you enjoy and come here for more vi upcoming videos because there are going to be many more videos here in this channel so thank you keep on smiling stay blessed and stay fabulous bye